want to show you this book that we've been trying out for a few months now. Um, it's Jules Day Quadro. Um, I've actually really enjoyed using this bugger. It's great for just for every day for out and about. I mean, we live in a town, but we have lots of country walks, so it's been great for everything really. I um, just want to show you a few of the key features. Um, it's got some great big wheels, which we will love. Um, swivel front wheels, or they can be fixed, whichever way around you fancy. Also, one thing that I absolutely love about this is how high the chair is. Um, my little boy's three, he's got autism, he likes to be up and about. Um, it doesn't like to be cramped in. So one of the main things we like about this is the huge hood. It means if he's getting a bit stressed out, a bit overwhelmed, he can just close it off. He can have a bit of time to himself. Um, the leg is great, nice and extendable. So I might say if your kids, you know, if it's a larger toddler um, or like mine three on the bigger side, there's plenty of space for them there. It's full of reclining, so we can go all the way back and round. But we've never used it like that, we've always just used up right, it's a bit too old for having naps now. One of the things the hubby likes is the expandable one. I'm a bit of a shorter, unless I'm wearing heels, so it's great that we can both do that. The next thing I'm going to show you is how it folds down. Um, for quite a big, substantial bugger, it actually folds down a lot smaller than you think. Um, just clip. There's two little things on the side here. Hold them down to get the handlebars all the way down. And then there's a couple more little clips, front and back, which you just slot in once that's there. And slot it into the slightly laid back position. Sorry, I'm so full of cold off there with me. Hold, squeeze, fold straight down. And then lift, pull, slots in, and there we go. It's really easy, really easy to do once you've figured it out. Just open it back up again. Pull the edge out. Back in position. 